Here we go, 625, time for the stories that are trending now. It's tough being alone, especially on Valentine's Day, but a basketball player is at least trying to pretend he has friends. Tennessee's Jordan Bowen shot a few free throws all by himself. Give a little high five there. He's like, listen, if I gotta be down here to shoot these <laughs> foul shots, everyone's back there. It's a technical. He's shooting. And he's like, no problem. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it. A little high five. <laughs> After each shot, he went and thanked all his imaginary teammates. Pretty good. Pretty good. It's right. School was closed yesterday in West Springfield, Massachusetts, and the mascot was pretty excited to break the news. Aaron, guess what day it is? Guess what day it is? Tim, 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 Tim. Guess what day it is? Yeah, it's a snow day. Woohoo! It's a <laughs> snow day in West Side. <laughs> <laughs> the video, of course, is a parody of Geico's Hump Day commercial, which features a camel. <laughs> All right, the top dog from the Westminster Dog Show enjoyed the spoils of his big win in New York City. The Wire Fox Terrier King posed for the camera atop the Empire State Building, but the dog saved the best for last when he ate steak and sardines ah. in Midtown. He's wow. certainly living like him. the king that he is. He's like, give me that. Two inseparable shelter dogs are certainly feeling the love this Valentine's Day. This is a great story. Jack and Diane got married last week in Augusta, Maine. There's even a song about Jack and Diane. Yeah, a little ditty about, little about Jack and Diane. About Jack and Diane, right? and Diane yeah. <laughs> Just up for the occasion. And the two dogs were found together last year. So the staff at the shelter hope uh, th this video encourages potential owners to adopt these dogs together. Oh, they can't break them up. No. No, they have it's, to go together. It's they're puppy married. love. They're married, right. That's our trending now story about Jack and Diane, two dogs doing the best that they can. We'll be right back. Oh, good one.